What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Kicker Scuba Marina. And if you are new to our channel, do me a huge favor. Make sure you click this little subscribe button over here and ding that little bell as well. That way you guys will be notified every time we upload new content. Now here behind me is a place called Gray Quarry. We're out here in Kingsport, Tennessee. And this is a very, very popular dive site. And it's actually my first trip up here. Now our shop comes up here with students all the time, but this is my first time up here. So hopefully we're gonna have a good dive. But what I wanna focus on in this video is why does divers like quarries? They're cold, they're dark, they're deep, there's usually not a lot to see. Well, actually, most quarries got quite a bit to see and they provide great training grounds for all types of divers. So if you're a cave diver, there's plenty of stuff that you can actually penetrate. If you are a technical diver, there's plenty of stops along the way. Maybe there's platforms or maybe there's a houseboat or something where you've got different levels where you can practice your stage decompression stops. So quarries offer a great training grounds for all types of divers, whether they're new open water divers, whether they're experienced tech divers, or even if they're instructors, because this is gonna give them a great place to get out here and train with students. With that being said, I'm gonna head down here to the bottom. We're gonna jump in and see what this quarry has to offer.
there you go guys we just got finished up we had an absolutely awesome dive i think we got hit about 45 minutes on that dive there max depth was about 65 feet and visibility was anywhere between say 30 and 50 foot of viz um, i say that because we definitely had about 50 foot of viz there but it's still a green quarry and as you can see here as the sun kind of goes across the sky there's going to be a lot of dark spots so you can't really see or focus that full 50 foot but it was an absolutely gorgeous dive here um, there was a couple things we didn't see i know there's a school bus here we didn't see and there's actually a small little cave entrance uh, it's not really a cave it's just kind of a swim through but they've got it blocked off it's actually directly underneath me over here to the left so we actually didn't get to see that, but there's a, another airplane here besides the ones over here on the wall, which is pretty cool, by the way. And also, you can actually see that from the interstate. So here behind me is the interstate, and as you're coming up, you can see that airplane uh, as you're getting close to the quarry. Um, if you're interested in diving this place, you're going to have to check in at a local shop called Smoky Mountain Divers. It's just right up the street here. It's a great group of guys on that. I know the owner, William, uh, personally, some of his instructors, Tony, I, kn I know the guys really well and they will take very very good care of you so if you're here in this area this kingsport area definitely come out to gray quarry go check out smoky mountain divers let those guys give you uh, some pointers here They're, they've got a map plus in the changing areas here there's maps as well um, there's also another changing shack here that you can change in but the one down below has got heaters in it so if you're diving in the winter time like we are right now makes a great place to go change and there's maps of the entire quarry there so it'll show you the depths it'll show you what's there um, there's not really lines going to everything there are some buoy markers that drop down but they don't really have navigational lines so you might need those maps to be able to use your compass to go uh, from one destination to the night but guys i really hope you enjoyed this video we're going to start doing more tour videos we're going to be hitting some of our local quarries next i'm also going to be showing you some dive sites here in our local lake and then as we go out and dive new places we're going to be making videos we started a couple years ago the can you dive it series um, and it didn't really take off the way we wanted it to so what we're going to start doing is actual tour dives for you we're going to go out dive a spot tell you what we think of it we're going to give it a rating would i say this is a five star i'd say this is probably about a four star just because of where it's located how far it is from us um, and the facilities are not that bad uh, but they're you still got to travel to go get air fills and things like that. So I'm gonna give this four out of five stars. Still an excellent place to come. Like I said, our shop's actually been using this place quite a while, but this is my first trip up here. So I really like it. I think it's something I'll definitely come back and dive again. But guys, let me know down in the comment section below if you've ever dove Grave Quarry, what you think of it. Guys, if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up. Definitely share it as well. As always, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Like us on Facebook, pin us on Pinterest, subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys, we appreciate your business.